I'm going to show you how to do the Jir Turgamak shrine in the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. This shrine is over here, up in the sky, in this region of the map. What you can do is take the sky view tower, land on the fl like the spinning circle thing in the sky, and inside of it is this shrine. All right, I'm going to show you how to do this one. So this one's also called a flying device. Now, in order to do this one, it's actually a really fun puzzle. So we're going to go over here immediately on the left. We're going to take this wing. We're going to grab it from the front like this and then drop it so it falls into us. That way we don't just lose it. Then it's going to take it over here and we need to just get it. It doesn't really need to go the whole way, just however. All right, so now we're going to grab it. Set it up here. We're going to take this cart. Uh, we're going to leave it sideways and we're going to put this on the cart and attach them. Then we're going to grab it from the front again and then try to line this up square so it doesn't go off the sides and then drop it and climb onto it. You always want to have it facing you like that when you go to drop it on an incline so it doesn't roll away from you. Sometimes when it's moving at all away from you, it's hard to grab it correctly. So we don't need to have it go the whole way up this, but it's fun to see if we can. Okay, we didn't make it. All right, need to grab that before it falls off. Get it up here so it doesn't roll away. Okay, so now what we got to do is the chest. The chest is up there. Now, here's how we get the chest. We're going to take this and go set it over there. We're going to take this and we're going to put it on the end like that. And just for ex for good measure, we're going to put this on the nose like that. We're going to grab it from the end. And we're going to take this and put it over this gap like that. Oh my god, I almost jumped off the map. Oh, okay, there we go. Then you're going to use Ascend and Ascend up to the chest. Inside of the chest, you'll find a large Zonite, which is actually a pretty decent thing for once. A lot of times those rewards are just terrible. Now you're going to grab this with Ultra Hand. You're going to take it over here. You're going to pull it apart. And you're going to put this on top of the cart. And you're going to take this. And you're going to have it so this side is facing away on the tail. And then you're going to take the whole device. And you're going to go over here with it. Try to line it up. It doesn't have to be perfect. Just roughly line it up so it doesn't go off the side and roll and tumble. Then you get on it and just stand in the middle. And now we are in flight. Be careful not to stand too far to the front or else you'll nosedive to your death. And don't go too high or you may like basically stall out. So we're going to go right here. And then we're going to see if we can stick the landing. We'll see how good of a, of a wing pilot I am. I'm a terrible pilot. A terrible pilot. Ah, I stuck the landing. I take it back. I'm, I'm, a, I'm an average pilot. We don't have to stop it, but I just feel like I have to. All right. Then after that, we're at the end of the shrine. You can go ahead and activate this and get your light of blessing so there you go guys that's how to do that puzzle if you had any issues with this shrine now you know where it is how to get to it and how to beat it in the legend of zelda tears of the kingdom